starring Tommy Rettig as Jeff Miller. Jan Clayton as his mother, Ellen. George Cleveland as Gramps. And, of course, Lassie. She's licking the jam off your face. I was only tasting it. I want to trade. Trade what? This. It's real silver with jewels. The red ones are rubies and the green ones are emeralds. It's a gypsy bracelet and it's very valuable. It says made in Japan. That's nothing. Gypsies are all over. How'd you like to give it to your mother? I'll trade you for it. Look at how it shines. You ever seen anything like it before? You want to trade? Trade what? The bracelet. For stuff to eat. Bread and milk and flour and sugar and... some of that jam. You want to trade? If you don't, give it back. All you want for it is stuff to eat? Sure. But lots of stuff. Well, okay. Shake on it. Uh, I gotta water my coat before I can go down to the lake. You got a coat? Uh-huh. Where is he? In the bar. Can I ride him? No. I can ride good, Jeff. Please let me ride him. I told you no. He's too young and he's gotta be broken first. Oh, he's beautiful. I love him. Look out, I gotta water him. I never saw such a beautiful horse. What's his name? Domino. Domino. Jeff, you've got to let me ride him. You've got to. I can ride bareback. How many times do I have to tell you? Nobody can ride him until he's trained. I can train him. I know all about horses. My grandfather taught me. Better watch out or he'll nip you. He won't nip me. Will you, Domino? I make friends with horses all the time. Well... Come on, if you're coming. I will come back. We will run. Like the wind. Come on. <laughs> now I will tell your fortune. It will be a good fortune because you are blessed by the fates. I am? Indeed, yes. There are lights around your head. <laughs> oh, you cannot see them. Only the gypsies are so gifted. Come. Sit down. Now place your fingertips on mine. in the stall. I told him at least a dozen times to stay around the house when we're away. Well, it's near supper. He'll be coming along. Oh, please. Can't you leave those things until he comes? It ain't gonna kill me. Now what? Come 
here a minute. Look, somebody's cleaned out the icebox. I had half a ham, almost two dozen eggs, and a full jar of milk. You sure? Of course I'm sure. Hmm. Good heavens, my preserves and fruit. Some more stuff missing? Mm-hmm. Oh, sugar, cereal, flour, canned soup, pickles. Uh, Tramps likely back door was open. Hi, Mom. Hi, Gramps. Mom, look what I got for you. It's real silver with rubies and emeralds. And Grandpa changed three pennies into dimes. He's magic. And Tina's mother told my fortune for me. And Just she a minute, said dear. That... Just a minute. How many times have I asked you to stay close to the house when we're away? Well, I did. I just went over to the lake. I... Sure, and while you were over at the lake, we got robbed. Robbed? Oh, well, now, it's nothing serious, just some food missing. Oh, nobody robbed us. I traded it to Tina for the bracelet. What? Tina wanted something to eat, so I traded it to her for the bracelet. You gave away all that food for this piece of junk? Oh, it's not junk. It's real silver. And the red stones are rubies, and the green ones are emeralds. Silver my foot. What is? Oh, now stop it, both of you. Jeff, who is Tina? Well, she's a gypsy girl. A gypsy? They're camping down at the lake. Who's camping? How many of them? Oh, Dad, now please. Well, there's Tina and her mother and her father and her grandfather. Where are you going? I'm going to run them off. You'll do nothing of the sort. There ain't no gypsies going to camp on my property. Well, Gramps, they're nice people. You march right upstairs and get cleaned up for supper. Now look here, Ellen. You heard me. March. And you'd better find some eggs in the hen house or there'll be no supper. Don't you like the bracelet? Oh, Jeff, of course I do. It's very pretty. I never had one like it. Thank you, dear. You're welcome. After I finish the dishes, Jeff and I'll go down and ask him to leave. What do you mean, ask him? I'll go down and tell him. That's just what I'm afraid of. You and your temper. I'll be in the setting room if you need me. Mom, all gypsies aren't bad, are they? Oh, of course not, dear. Just like all people aren't bad. Finish up. I'll help you, Mom. Well, thank you, sir. That's Tina's mother. She sings and dances, and her grandfather plays the violin. the dishes. We can do them later. Okay. Well, we have visitors. Oh. Welcome. Welcome. And this is my mom. Oh, we are happy to know you. This is my husband, Zerka, and my father, Grafo. How do you How do? You do? Like Where's it? Tina? Who knows? She is like the wind. Baby, she's catching fireflies for a magic lantern. <laughs> My mom knows some of your gypsy songs. Oh, no, Jeff, I, d I don't. Oh, yes, you do. Well, just that one. Which one? Marishka. Marishka? <laughs> Sing for us. Oh, no, I, I would rather you sang. <laughs> I am always singing. Now it is for you. For a favor. Tomorrow we are leaving for the carnival. Hmm? Please. Well, all right. Will you start? Sure.
The Colt, he's gone. What? They stole him. What? Oh, Damn no. Damn it, the Colt, he's gone. Why did you run away from me? I would not hurt you. All I wanted was to ride you. Because you are so beautiful. You are wet from all the running. And thirsty, too, I bet. Drink. Drink good. I only wish you were my horse. So I could teach you to run fast like the wind. And I could ride you at all the carnivals. And the people would clap their hands and they would say, Ho, ho, it is Tina and Domino. but you wouldn't listen. Damn it. Please. I didn't hurt him or anything. Tina. She took him out and tried to ride him. Tina, why did you do this? I've told you never to touch what does not belong to you. What'd she do, ride him? No, he ran away from her. I'm sorry. Tina has done a bad thing. Oh, I'm sure she didn't mean any harm. It is not what she meant. She is a gypsy. And because of what is said about gypsies, she must be twice careful. Do you understand, Tina? Yes, Papa. You better pack up and get. Dad, they're leaving in the morning. If you wish us to go tonight. Oh, no, it's, it's perfectly all right. Again, I am sorry. For myself and for Tina and for my family. Your son was good to us. It is not a nice way to repay goodness. Good night. Good night. Good night. Goodbye, Tina. Goodbye. Better rub him down, Jeff. Don't want him to get cold. Well, if I can't be of any help here, I'll go do my dishes. Tina didn't really try to steal him, Gramps. Well, she just loves horses and... Never mind. Rub him down. a lot, Jenny, and I, I'm sorry to bother you. Right here, mother. Doc Weaver's in Capital City, and there's no way of reaching him. Oh, I... Do you need some water? Be careful, it's hot. Mom, couldn't I go get Graffo? Who? Graffo, Tina's grandfather. He's magic. Maybe he could help Domino. Jeff, magic is a trick. It, it can't help sorrow nor cure illness. Well, Graffo says that he can make magic with anything. He can even make seeds grow. If he can do that, couldn't he cure illness? Take this out to Gramps. I'll try to vet it, Preston. Lassie, go to the lake and bring Graffo here. The lake? 
sheep where the gypsies are. Bring Bravo. The old man. <laughs> She woke me up. What do you want? She wants me to go someplace. I'll go. No, you'll have driving to do tomorrow. I'll go. Can I go, Mama? No, you go to sleep. What can it be, Zerka? I don't know. But the dog would not come if someone did not send it. What is it, young man? It's Domino, my cold. He's dying. What's he doing here? The nostril scriver. There is still a chance. Can your magic make him well? I will try. The cramp is in the heart. What are you lying to the boy for? The horse is dying, and neither you or your magic can do anything about it. There are many kinds of magic. The best of all is the magic of love. Come, I'll show you. You will kneel by his head and talk softly to him. Talk to him. Tell him we are trying to help him. Please get well, Domino. We're all trying to help you because we all love you. Even Lassie. Maybe if you just try a little bit, it'll be all right. We couldn't get Doc Weaver, and we couldn't get the vet in Creston, but Groffo knows about horses, and he's doing everything he can. You can all go to the hospital. You're the there's nothing can be done about it. I know. But listening and talk to that cult as though it were human. Yeah. Got me too. The gypsy's doing the right thing, but I'm afraid it's too late. Unless there is magic in love. My darling, you did the best you could. But why did they tell me there was any magic when there isn't? Not any kind. Jeff. He's coming round. Dad. Domino. Domino. Talk to him. Domino, it's me, Jeff. And Lassie's right here. He's going to leave. Come over here. Quickly. Up. Come on. Up. <laughs> Boy. Thanks, Gruffle. Thanks. I am not the only one you helped. You worked the magic. Hi. And I had to come up and tell you. Was me made Domino sick? I gave him water when he was hot. I didn't mean to make him sick. I wouldn't ever do a thing like that. Honest, I wouldn't. I love him. Then why'd you do it? He almost died. I didn't know it would make him sick. Please forgive me, Domino. You see? He knows I... I didn't mean to hurt him. Well, okay. 
But stop crying. In a couple of months, he'll be trained to a bit in the saddle, so you can buy here, you can ride him. Can I? Can I really? Sure. <laughs> 